This isn't an action movie, it's a real life rescue. <laughs> Macomb County Sheriff's Deputy Nicole Myron leapt from her moving car into another to help a driver having a medical emergency. You good? You okay? Is this park? I don't even think I hit the side of the truck or anything. I did a clear jump in, put the vehicle in park, and uh, here we are. September 12th, Deputy Myron was in the passenger seat. Deputy Anthony Gross driving. He's a trainee, his second week on the job, when they responded to reports of a car driving erratically down Gratiot. He isn't responding to us pulling him over, the lights, sirens, nothing like that. So as we get on the side, you can kind of see, you know, his, he's in a daze, he's an elderly gentleman. The car was going slowly, but they didn't have much time. We got to stop him for 16 mile. I'm thinking he's already going through a couple red lights, passing through Harrington. And that that's when Deputy Myron realized. I'm going through, I'm gonna have to jump over there. I was just looking at his driver mirror, my passenger mirror, just trying to line it up that way with those two cars and just making sure. Luckily, everybody else was kind of dispersing because we had our lights and sirens on. Deputy Gross's driving was perfect. It allowed Deputy Myron to lean out the window. She tried using her window punch. Luckily, the driver was able to roll that window down and then the leap and rescue. How did it feel afterward? Like, wow, we just did that? Like, that just happened? But in the moment, it was just so focused on it, just making sure everything was gonna be all right. I'm proud of, of both of them and, and proud of all the, the men and women that work here at the Sheriff's Office because every day they're willing to, to think on their feet and jump into action without hesitation. Even if that jump is literal. You okay, is this perfect? The driver received medical attention and is recovering. Scott Walchek, Fox 2 News.